story of Nature's Recreations starts when I'm 10 years old, cutting grass in my parents' neighborhood, just uh, trying to make some money. Once I got out of the mowing side of things, I really wanted to be the pond guy in St. Louis. My goal was to emulate a lot of the aquascape mentalities and, and really become an artist in my craft. For us, it's the, the friendship and the bond that we create but it's also the ecology of things. We just love doing this. I'm an Eagle Scout. I grew up hiking and camping in the woods and water has always been something I've been drawn to. What I love the most about water features is just the, the passion that we get in the fulfillment out of doing them ourselves, but the, the interaction with the clients. You know, I'd always joke with clients when we first started doing ponds, trying to sell them ponds, that you know, I did landscaping for several years and I never get a call from a customer saying that they're sitting on their patio staring at their shrubs. And if I did, I'd always be like, oh, I think I might need to run away from this client. But you get that with, with pond people. You know, they just fall in love with what we do and I've created a bond and friendship with all of my clients. I don't ever have that same relationship, or I didn't, with landscape customers. We try to look at the landscape as a holistic thing now. We used to just try to sell the pond. And our goal when we're trying to design a feature in somebody's space is to try to incorporate every element of the landscape into that and also bring some of the elements of the pond outside by you know, adding some accent boulders so that it makes it look like it's believable. And the best compliment we ever get from customers is saying that they think that this looks like it's been there forever. You know, we don't build volcanoes in people's yards. We, we set large boulders that have purpose and, and really plan each and every you know, step of that process so that it, it appears like it has, has always been there. My background was art. I love to draw, I love that um, you know, side of the industry and I just um, set myself out to be the best. You know, whether it was in St. Louis or whether it was in you know, the United States. Our, our goal was to try and achieve the highest level of, of artistry that we could. It was a very fulfilling, satisfying moment that I had in my career and, uh, and it was just probably one of, the, one of the highlights that we've had in a number of years. The difference in hiring a certified aquascape contractor versus just Joe Schmo landscaper is going to be the, the training, the education, and you know the experience level. You're, you're working with top of the line products from the world's largest manufacturer. You have every resource at your fingertips and you're going to get the job done right. You're not going to get the, oh I wish I would have done it a different way. It's going to be the first time and the last time that you do a project.